Okay, let me get you guys set up. Hopefully this doesn't fall. What is up guys and welcome back to my channel. So your girl is just now getting home. Woke up this morning and I'm like, this house needs to be cleaned. So the first thing I do is open up the fridge to pour me a cup of iced coffee and no coffee. So of course I get dressed, I get my daughter and we literally only have about 30 minutes to get to the store, check out and then get back home before she has to be on her first meeting for the day. So we get in the car, rush to the store, run back to the freezer out, did not have the iced coffee that I drink. They really didn't have any iced coffee. They didn't even have milk. So I'm not sure what's up with that. So I'm just like, okay, I'll go home and I'll make some hot coffee. Really didn't want hot coffee, but I'm on a time schedule, so so I just have to make whatever work. But on the way out from the store, up out of the cash registers, they have these little drink refrigerators. And this is the coffee that I found. It's Dunkin's Ice Coffee. Believe it or not, even though I love iced coffee, I've never tried Starbucks's iced coffee or Dunkin' iced coffee. I usually just stick with the Delight iced coffee that is sold at like all the grocery stores that has the French vanilla. So whenever I seen this Dunkin' iced coffee with French vanilla, I picked it up and surprisingly, it's pretty good. So this is what saved today's video because I was in a bad mood and I was just over it and I'm like, I cannot start my day without the coffee. So I was just gonna go home and chill out on the couch until my daughter was done with her meetings. So yeah, this little guy is what saved today's video. So cheers to iced coffee. Because of this little guy, we are going to be doing a bikini haul video. So let's get started. So you guys know that I'm obsessed with tanning. I like to go outside and get a natural tan. Once in a while, I'll go to the tanning bed. I used to go to the tanning bed a lot when I was younger, but now that I'm getting older, I know that the tanning bed is not the smartest decision to do. You get tanned fast, but it's not very healthy for you or your skin. So I've been getting into self tanners. I have tried a lot of self tanners. Got a few from Walmart that I didn't really like. And then also Walgreens, I've gotten a few. And they were pretty costly. So I thought they have to work for the price, but I ended up not really liking them. So you guys know that I love Bath and Body Works and I love Victoria's Secret. I love all their lotions and sprays. So while I was shopping for some summer scents, I ran across two tannin products that I had no clue that they sold. And that is the bronzed coconut self tanning water. And then also the bronzed coconut self tanning drops. So when I first seen these, I thought the name sounds so familiar. And that is because for the last past couple years, whenever I'm shopping for summer scents, I like smells that smell like coconut and tropical, pretty much like tanning lotion. I love the smell of tanning lotions. And I always look for that in a spray. And Victoria's Secret never seems to disappoint. They always have those type of smells that I'm looking for. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, this is the body spray that I usually buy from Victoria. Every single year, the bottle changes. They put a new design on it but it is called the bronze coconut and this smells like toasted coconut and dreamy sunbeams i absolutely love this smell i've got three bottles of this and plus the lotions so whenever i was adding smells to my cart of course i added this and since i bought this they recommend it the self tanning spray and drops. I did buy these separately. This was $16 and I think this was about $11. And these are both in the same scent as the body spray that I love. So I'm like, let me look at the reviews. I looked at the reviews and didn't see any. Then I went to YouTube and looked up like reviews, videos of people using this. I found one review on this and the girl who used it acted like she loved it. So of course, I went back and added both of these to my cart and I got them within two days. This smells absolutely amazing and I feel like it really works. So as no, it hasn't been that warm out and I haven't really been able to get out in the sun only because it's like cloudy every single day. 
I have not been to the tanning bed. So the color that I have, it is not the darkest. Like I've been way darker, way bronzed. But this brownish color that I have to my skin is because of this spray. So it's really easy to apply. You don't want to just spray it on you all over without rubbing it in. And if you're going to rub it in, I would do it kind of fast. I like to rub it in really good to fully coat myself. So as soon as I take a shower, this does not wash off me. I do not see my color fade any. This actually keeps me looking bronzed and tan for up to five to six days. So yeah, if you have not tried this and you're looking for a tanner or a bronzer, definitely pick this up. And if you do, after trying it, let me know what you think down in the comment section about it. So now that we've talked about the spray, I wanted to show you guys the self tanning drops. So this actually has shimmer in it. So when you put this on and step out in the sun, you are going to be shining. So let me read the back for you guys. Here's how to use this. Mix four to six drops per palmful of lotion. Apply the body as usual. Wash hands immediately after use. Wait until dry to dress. You can use this daily to deepen your color. So this has to be used with a lotion. This is what the top looks like. And it smells so good. So I use this after I've used the spray. So you can use this with any type of lotion. It does not have to be lotion from Victoria. It can be lotion from Walmart. Since it does have to be used with a lotion, I have tons of lotion at home, but you guys know I'm so extra. And um, I went ahead and bought a summer lotion from Victoria. So this is pink pineapple shaved coconut and summer crush. And it smells absolutely amazing. So I like to use this whenever I'm using this because this already smells like summer in a bottle. And then you just top it off with this pineapple lotion. It smells absolutely amazing. And I actually got this on the website from Victoria for $6. And it's originally like $14. But yeah, I just wanted to let you guys in on what items I have been using lately. Since it's not summer yet and it's kind of hard to catch a tan outside, these are what has been keeping me the color that I am and I absolutely love them. So I wanted to recommend them to you guys. So now that I've shared that, let's get into the bikini haul. So I think all of the bikinis that I purchased are from Shein. So all of their bikinis come in these cute little tropical bags and this is the first bikini that i stumbled across it's the bikini top look how cute guys it's just got like all the colors of the rainbow all the neon colors that i absolutely love and then these are the bottoms i love the big ties on the side it's so cute. This is going to look so good with the tan. And you guys are not going to believe the price for this bikini. This bikini was $13. And the quality is amazing. It has a really good stretch to it. It is so soft on the inside, so it's going to be very comfortable. So far, it is my favorite. Next bikini made a lot like the first bikini that I just showed you guys, just different colors. So the reason I got this bikini is because it reminds me of like sunset colors. It's all tie-dyed. So cute. This orange and yellow is going to look amazing with the tan. So now I'm going to show you guys the bikini cover-up that I got for that sunset bikini since it is orange and yellow. This is the bikini cover-up. It is very bright neon orange. And this is also very soft. It's got a ton of stretch to it. So could you imagine this underneath this? It is just going to look so good. The pops of yellow you're going to be able to see underneath. They did not have other colors in this. Because you guys know I would have bought, bought one of every color. But yeah, this is definitely my favorite bikini cover of this year. And once I tell you guys the price of this bikini cover up, you guys are not going to believe me. This bikini cover up was $5. Actually, below $5. It was $4 and like 64 cents. I wish that they would have had it in other colors because I would have bought every single color. So the next bikini that I'm going to show you is a three piece set. This was $15. 
Well, this is a neon yellow set. It looks green on camera, but it is actually yellow. This is the top that goes with, but that is not all. I also got the tie side skirt to go with. Isn't that so cute? If you feel like this bikini is not really for you, only because of the bottom, they are very cheeky. You can just wrap this around your waist and you don't have to worry about that. So in this bikini set, they had it in neon pink, neon orange, a true bright yellow, black and white. So they have this in every color option. So if this is too bright for you or this isn't really your color, they have a ton of other colors that will work for you. Moving on to a pink bikini. I actually wore this bikini on my vacation to Panama. I didn't pack all my bikinis with me. Only because it wasn't like 80, 90 degree weather. The highest it got down there was 75 while we were there. So yeah, this one's also a three-piece set. You get the skirt, such a bright neon pink. And then this is the very hot pink top that goes with. This is so neon pink and it's not picking up on camera, but it's got the little diamonds on the sides. And I do not have the bikini bottoms in here with this. I'm guessing they are still in my suitcase. I still have not fully unpacked from our trip to Panama. But the bottoms look exactly like this. The bottoms do not tie at the sides. They've actually got this little chain bling on each side. And they are very stretchy. And this set was about $11. And it is a three-piece set. I absolutely love them. Okay, so the next bikini set that I'm going to show you guys, I got a lot of compliments on this little skirt that goes with the bikini. So these are the bottoms. They're very high-waisted, but you can move them down to the side and they look just as cute. This bottom is actually called a lettuce cut bottom. As you guys can see, these are so cute. They are very cheeky. That's why I got this little skirt to go with. And look, it's so blinged out. And when the sun shines, it catches every one of these little rhinestones. And it is adjustable. This is so stretchy. Look how stretchy this is. And I know that it looks itchy, but it's not. I thought that it was perfect. I did take this on vacation with me, but I did not wear the bottoms or the top with this. I actually wore my Victoria's Secret bikini, and then I just layered this over it. But yeah, I got the black as a set, and then this was actually separate. This was about $13, I want to say, and then the black bikini set was $11. Okay, so the next two sets that I'm going to show you guys are technically bathing suits. You know how Victoria's Secret has the swim to gym collection? So you can either wear their swimsuits to swim in or you can wear it to the gym because they, they are shorts. That's exactly what these are. This is the top. And it just reminds me of like cotton candy or clouds up in the sky. You know, whenever the sun's setting and the clouds look almost pink. And then you have your pops of blue. That is the main reason I got this because just look at the color, so cute. And then these are the bottoms that go with. So as you guys can see, I tied this side up. And then this side's just normal. So you can wear them either way. You control the length of these shorts. So if you want them super short, you just tie them up, but if you don't, you can just leave them as is and just put a little tie right here. But I did not buy this set to like go to the pool in. I bought this set to wear in the summer, kind of as a two-piece outfit. Since these are high-waisted, they cover a lot of skin and then the top comes to about right here. So you cannot tell that it's a swimsuit. It'll just look super sporty. And this set was $14. They had this set in solid colors and then other 
colors tie-dyed. And then I got the same exact set, but in a solid color. I got red. And then of course the bottoms. So again, I've got one side tied up and then one side just down. They are high-waisted. They are very stretchy. I mainly got this set because a lot of my tennis shoes and sneakers are red. I love Jordans. I love Nikes. And a lot of those shoes are red and black or just red and white or solid red. So that's why I picked this up so that it would match my shoes. And then the last bikini cover-up I got is this neon tie-dye cover-up. It does come with a little hood on it. And it looks kind of long. No, actually, it doesn't look long. But this is so cute. The camera is doing it no justice. It is so neon. And I can pretty much wear this with every single bikini that I showed you guys. This was $10. And it is super stretchy. It's actually a one-size-fits-all. So this is going to fit a small, medium, and large. I just think that it is so cute. And then the last thing that I'm going to show you in this video kind of goes along with the bikinis. I mean, I bought them whenever I bought all the bikinis and I specifically tried to match them to the bikinis. So these are all the hats that I purchased. This is a really cute neon pink hat. It's just a ball cap. I like to pull my hair through the back since you guys know my hair is so long and Whenever it's hot outside and real muggy, I don't like to do anything to my hair, but just pull it back through a baseball cap. So I got this hat. This was $5. I also got this at Shein. And then I got this neon yellow slash green hat to go with my all neon yellow bikini. I also got this one from Shein and it was $5 as well. And then this is not a full hat. I got this to go with my bikini cover-up and my sunset bikini. I also have a lot of clothes that are in these colors. So I can just match my shirts to these ball caps and just pair them with jean shorts for the summertime. But I got this hat only because I like to put my hair up in a big top bun in the summer to keep it off my neck and back because who wants hair sticking to them when they're like sweaty? So yeah, I just thought that this would be super cute. It's still going to block the sun from me and I can either do a really high ponytail or I can put a top bun on top of my head. And I also got this from Shein. This was not $5. This was $3 and some change and they had this in every single color. So yeah, so far this is all the bikinis and cover-ups that I bought for this summer. I'm going to try not to buy any more, but you guys know um, I have a very bad shopping problem. So yeah, you guys know that that's just my thing. But I wanted to give you guys this video just to give you guys a break from the cleaning and to get you guys excited for summer and to show you guys the bikinis from Shein. So yeah, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you are not already a subscriber here on my channel for more videos like this one. Also, comment down below and let me know what bikini you guys like the best out of this little haul that I just showed you guys. So, I look forward to seeing which bikini was you guys' favorite. And like always, thanks for watching.